Welcome to Como Student Community Cooperative. To help your transition here be as smooth as possible, we have put together a short summary of important information regarding life at CSCC. Surrounded by fellow University of Minnesota students and their families, we hope your time here is both beneficial and memorable. We strongly encourage you to read through the CSCC lease and your resident handbook completely. There you will find full descriptions of our co-op's governance system and the responsibilities of stockholding residents, as well as residential policies and regulations. Rent is due on the first of each month and can be paid until 5 p.m. on the fifth day of the month. If the fifth falls on a non-working day, the last day to pay rent without penalty would be the very next business day. If the rent is not received by this deadline, a late fee will be charged. All utilities, heat, water, electricity, and trash are included in the rent. CSCC residents are allowed to have extended family members in their apartment with an additional charge per person per month. Extended family members, such as residents' parents or siblings, are considered to be guests and are required to register at the CSCC office. Occupancy limits do apply. Each summer, residents may choose to place their own air conditioners in their apartments. There is an additional charge for each air conditioner per month of usage. This payment is due with the apartment's rent at the beginning of each month. A sticker decal is given to the resident for each air conditioner being used and it is to be displayed in the upper corner of the apartment's kitchen window. The monthly fee will be assessed to the resident each month until the sticker is returned to the office. Residents are not allowed to have clothes washers or dryers in their apartments. Any resident found in possession of these machines will be fined $250 and required to remove the appliance immediately. Dishwashers and extra freezers or refrigerators are allowed for an extra charge each month. There is no cost for on-site parking at CSCC. Residents are limited to two vehicles in the CSCC parking lots and must display the CSCC parking permit on their registered vehicles. Each apartment is also given a visitor pass for guests to park in our parking lots. We do not have assigned or covered parking. Residents are given two apartment keys during their move-in. If you lose your key, there is a fee for a key's replacement. There is also a fee for lockout assistance after the office's business hours. If you find yourself locked out of your apartment during business hours, please visit the office. After business hours, please call the after hours maintenance number. 612-378-0219. Laundry rooms are located in each building's walk-through coreway. Each laundry room has four card-operated washers and dryers operated by Matt Gray. You may purchase a laundry card and add money to it from the machine on the wall across from the doorway into CSCC's office. The machine accepts $5, $10, and $20 bills. If you ever find a washer or dryer out of order, please contact Matt Gray to report the problem. Each building has an accessible shared storage room that is located next to the laundry room. It is accessible with your apartment key. Each apartment has a roughly 2 foot by 4 foot space. Please make sure that your items fit securely in your allotted space and do not block the aisle. Items left in the aisles may be disposed of. Placing a request for maintenance service is quick and easy. Go to the CSCC website, which can be found at cscc.umn.edu. At the top of our page, there is a tab that reads Current Resident. Click on Maintenance Request, the second choice in the list that drops down. Then click the red hyperlink that reads Create a maintenance request. A window will immediately pop up requesting a username and password. Type fix it, all one word, for both prompts. You will be taken to the CSCC repair website and at the top left of the screen, click report a problem. This will create a new request for you to fill out, including your name and apartment number and a description of the problem and its urgency. This request will be sent immediately to the maintenance staff. Cardboard boxes should be flattened and food containers should be rinsed out before placing them in the recycling bins. 
Please do not include trash with the recycling. Check your Corway bulletin board for the complete list of recyclable items. There is a separate trash dumpster located next to the recycling bins in every parking lot. If you find that a dumpster is full, please take your trash to a different dumpster. Resident mailboxes are located on the first floor of each Corway, and there is a blue postal depository box outside of the CSCC office building for outgoing mail. When a large package arrives for a resident via United States Postal Service, it is stored in one of the tan postal storage boxes located outside of the CSCC office. A numbered key is then placed in the resident's mailbox, and residents may use this key to retrieve their package during business hours when the CSCC Community Center building is open. Other carriers, such as UPS and FedEx, will leave packages at your door. All residents are encouraged to purchase renter's insurance for their personal property or any damage they may cause to the apartment through negligence. CSCC is not responsible in any way for a tenant's personal belongings. Last but not least, The Spirit is CSCC's official newsletter that is distributed via email each week to all residents. Please read The Spirit for updates about policy changes, announcements, and community activities. All information presented in the newsletter is considered an official notification, and it is the responsibility of each resident to have read it. Thank you for choosing CSCC. We look forward to having you in our community.